Today's going to be a fun day of polishing. I'm at a very good friend of mine's house, uh, Stan Fries, and you can see these uh, beautiful cars he's got out here. But Stan Fries and I have known each other since 1978. I painted a Corvette for him a long, long time ago, and uh, I'll let you uh, let you hear from Stan. <laughs> Yeah, Tom and I, uh, I met Tom when he painted my 1962 Honduras Maroon Corvette. And I, at that time, was the leader of the Disneyland band. And I had bought this Corvette from uh, the trumpet player, Eddie Erickson, in the Disneyland <laughs> band. And uh, it needed paint bad. So all the Corvette people said, oh, you got to go see Tom because he's the best there is. So I went up there on Harbor Boulevard and uh, Tom painted and did a great job on my 62 and we've just been friends ever since. So I've just recently retired from Disney as a uh, director of talent booking and uh, casting, uh, but formerly the Disney World band leader in 1971 and then Disneyland band leader for a long time. And a lot of musicians like cars. And uh, so I was lucky enough to be able to steal a few of them and, and uh, Tom took care of them for me and still <laughs> is and uh, so, it was fun to have him over again this morning and take a look at this 62, which is kind of a... Can you tell us about them, Stan? Can yeah, you tell us about these cars you, right here? First of all, I'd like to tell you about my sickness, because I've owned this car <laughs> three times. I've owned the same car three times, 1962. It's got the original block in it, but other than that, everything is different. It's got a five-speed Tremec. It's got power steering. It's got uh, power disc brakes. A five-speed yeah, in a 62. Yep, yeah, it's got a, a Tremec five-speed, uh, blah, 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 power steering, power brakes. Wow, uh, yeah, power two steering. Two tops. Beautiful. And, yeah, isn't that fun? So I sell it, and then I wish that I had it back so that I pay more money to buy it back. <laughs> and I just recently bought it back out of Arizona. Wow. And... Um, yeah, it's really a fun, but it's got the original block in it, as if who cares, but it does. And and the other sickness I have is everything has to be red on red. <laughs> if it's not red on red, it's communist, as far as I'm concerned. So, here, um, there's wow. what an original block looks like. Look at that. After you've done all of this other crazy Look stuff. Look at that. I hear Stan's phone going off. Yeah, now, exactly check out Stan's yard. Stan is. Well, I'm a tuba player. He's. <laughs> so, you can tell he's a tuba player. So anyhow, this is yeah, very all unique. my life I've been a tuba player, <laughs> and so uh, since 19, I started this collection of tubas that don't play. So if there's anybody out there that wants to learn to play the tuba, think they're going to steal one, get into the business, you're not because they don't play. And uh, I've been hanging them in this tree, and nobody has actually stolen them. Uh, I don't that's know what cool. they want it. But that's neat. My two sons are in music. Josh is a drummer. Jason is keyboard with uh, Green Day. Josh played with Sublime. And wow. Was with Nine Inch Nails and Sting and whatever. Wow. And they could care less about cars. <laughs> I don't, you know. Or What's tubas? wrong with them? I know. <laughs> What's wrong with them? Well, and as a result, they've got a lot of money. <laughs> yeah. They don't play the tuba, and they don't yeah. collect cars. Oh, so maybe that's rich. a good thing. Yeah. Yeah, right. And they don't drink. Hold on, just a minute. Somebody wants to talk to you. Yeah, that doesn't work. <laughs> um, anyhow, blah, blah, blah. So I've been collecting these horns, and and uh, this is where the boys grew up. Wow. And uh, had a good time. And, and they all like cars, but they don't love them. You know? And I'm glad that you like cars, because yeah, uh, I was that was one of the first paint jobs I did here in California, working for you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that so that best? was neat. God, I forget what I pay you for that. Like six hundred yeah. bucks or something <laughs> to paint a Corvette. Now it's like fifteen thousand. Yeah, you can't lucky. even buy the material for yeah. that now. But the reason they look so good is because of your product. I use it for everything. Oh, you that's know, great. Cleaner, Thanks, Dan. Everything. That's great. And uh, I, I've also got a '57 red on red uh, <laughs> Bel Air convertible yeah. that I use your product. On. Yeah. And so everybody at the car show will say, "Hey." What have you got? What is this? How can these things look so good? And then naturally, I tell them about it. Oh, that's and, great. Uh, here's, here's some, in fact, this, if you don't mind, I'd like to buy a little more from you. But, we got uh, well, all the product you need. Stan. Okay, great. Whatever you need. Perfect. All right, Stan, we got the cars all buffed out. The This one, the uh, 62, we did uh, all the buffing pads and uh, buffed it in direct sun. And then on the 63, we just waxed it with that wax you have in your hand. Yep. Q7 there uh, it is. CSI. CSI wax. Best so what do, you, what do you think, Stan? What do you think? I'll tell you what. 
45 years with Disney, one, <laughs> one of the things that I took away from that was an appreciation for excellence of detail. Yeah. You know, you look at Main Street, look at the painting and that, yeah. and how they've maintained uh, all the perfection there. And so I'm the same way with my cars. <laughs> you are. You know, you are. and so they got to be perfect. And so this is the only product, <laughs> and you're the only guy to do oh, it. Oh, thank you. have been here all day on this oh. thing, on these two cars, oh. and they look great. I mean, these are absolutely the best. They came out And nice. you're not these even are, paying me really... to say this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's the best. These are nice cars. Yeah. You, you've really got nice cars. You've always had nice cars. When I was a young guy, I was 18 years old doing your stuff. It, yeah. You always had the best of you uh, cars. You painted my first, uh, the, my, I first met you when I had my 62 Corvette in 1978. That was a long time ago. That was a long time Woo! ago. I know. I can't believe I'm that old. Yeah. I can't yeah, believe we've you, known each other. Listen, my social security number is three. That's how old I am. But yeah, so this is, uh, this color is called Real Red. Real Red. I got this through the... Uh, Maybe it's a House of Color color. Auction. I think it's House of Colors. Yeah, beautiful car. And, but it was like this when I bought it. Kind of a I retro. Bear Jackson auction is where it came from. This is a retro it's rod, a retro. right? It's got a... No door handles. Horse fast burn GM motor in it. It's got a five-speed Tremec. It's got automatic and air conditioning. Wow. Uh, disc power, disc brakes. It is a beautiful car. So, Sounds so, awesome, yeah, too. Yeah, it's an old guy's car. <laughs> the same with the 62. The 62, it's got uh, power disc brakes. It's got power steering. It's got air conditioning. Wow. It's got a five-speed Tremec. Um, <laughs>